Okay, so I've already got the stuff added to my cart. I was looking around. Go on there and buy them. The price on one of them went up by a dollar. It was thirteen ninety nine, fourteen ninety nine, and thirty nine ninety nine. Anyway, I am buying these mystery boxes because I everybody always sees these videos on there. And most of the time these people are going to like third party websites, I think, and they're getting like pallets full of stuff of like Amazon returns. Uh, th that's not what this is. These are just like random uh, mystery boxes that people put together on their stores. And I'm probably about to waste $70 on useless crap. But I want to try it and see what happens. Proceed to check out. No, thanks. Uh, taxes, of course, bring it up to about 75. Actually, 75, 75. It's a little weird. But, let's see. I've got this one, the first one here. It says, Mysteries Box, Anything Possible. Make Surprise Nice Gifts. All Items New Surprise. Gifts for Birthday, Party, Holiday. Should be here. I don't know what day this video is coming out. I'm ordering it on June 5th. It says it should be here from June 9th to June 14th. Uh, the next one here is SDST Mysteries Box. Makes nice. Basically the same thing, but a different store. And this one's supposed to be like toys and electronic toys and stuff. Like RC stuff. The, the top one just, like it literally says anything. And then... Uh, I kind of want to delete it myself, not get it, but I'm going to get it anyway just to see what happens. Because there's one review on there and it looked like they got like an ice cube tray or something. Something stupid. Like if I spend 15 bucks and get an ice cube tray, I'm going to be livid. Uh, that one ships, ships. It would be here June 9th to June 14th. This one has two free shipping options. For one for June 11th, one for June 14th. So why would I not choose the sooner one? Uh, and this one is forty dollars. And this one's supposed to be electronics, so phones, smartwatches, drones, anything electronic. And it's forty dollars. So I'm hoping that one's going to actually be something better. And then, yeah. Uh, the second one that's $15 says guarantees all commodities are new. It doesn't guarantee the worth, the value on it, but it says the value, the value is worth from 20 to $50, which I mean, as long as it's something that, that I think is cool, I think I'll be all right with it. Uh, the other one doesn't make any kind of guarantees. So let's go ahead and place the order. And now we wait for it to come in. Order placed. Thank you. And I will see you guys at the unboxing. So let's get to that. All right, we got something here. I'm not sure what it is. mystery box even though it's not actually a box this is a uh, guess it's a receipt it says action figure on it so I'm guessing this is one of the cheap like the $14 the, the one that's a uh, toys instead of electronics Actually, I recognize one of these. I don't know. <laughs> this is uh, a, a lot of people out there are gonna think this is really lame, but it's actually kind of cool. Uh, I don't know if they're all related from the same show, but uh, 
Yeah, I got... My, my girlfriend loves this show. I'm gonna give her this. That's great. It's... It's from the show on, on... I think it's on Netflix. It's called Miraculous. It's Ladybug and Cat Noir. It's like some French superhero cartoon for kids. But my girlfriend loves it. Uh, they're action figures from that show. There's two and then they're little avatar, I forget what they're called, little characters. The, the black cat there and then the ladybug. And then this, I guess he's also from the show, but I don't know what he is or who he is. Not that the camera can see anything but through the thing. I guess this is maybe one of the villains, I don't know. But I recognize these two. Let me see here. Now this is probably not worth what I paid for it. But at least it's something I recognize. And it's kind of cool. So, yeah. That's one down out of the way. I mean, I, that could have been a lot worse. Um, they're, they're bendable figures, too. That's interesting. Alright, so now we're just going to wait for the rest to come in. Number two. Still not in the box. It's just a, you know, a bag. Okay, um, this is from a different seller on Amazon selling a different mystery box. It's a different toy from the same damn show. This is a stuffed, stuffed animal thing of the, the black cat thing, whatever the hell that thing is from Miraculous. What the hell? And this is definitely not worth $15. The other one, at least there was like six different toys in it. All from the same show. There's just one this time. I really hope this isn't the $40 one. We still got one more package coming. So. That's a little disappointing. The last mystery box is here. Yes, I just opened the most expensive one with a drill. Yeah. Let's see. Where do I put the hole in? Okay, got this is the electronics one. This is the let's see, there's a charger. That's got multiple plugs on it. I don't know. Let's see. Okay. It's got a splitter, three way splitter, USB cord, goes to an iPhone, a Type C, and a regular micro USB. So that's cool, I guess. Let's see what else we got. Folding desktop phone stand. That's that's interesting. There's multiple stuff in this one. This is oh, that's kind of cool. It's a phone stand. You can sit it there and either record or watch a movie or whatever. 
that's pretty cool. That's my. You can put my phone on the charger. There you go. Like that. Right like that. Works pretty well. Not worth 40 bucks, but I'm happy with that. That's pretty cool. Earpods with remote control. What? Remote and mic. But they're for an iPhone. It's got the iPhone plug, it's Bluetooth, but like I don't I don't even have an iPhone, so let's see. Nice uh, little hard case that they come in. I mean, they look to be pretty decent, but they plug into your iPhone through the charging port, and I don't have an iPhone, so, uh, spoilers out there for somebody watching, they're getting a Christmas present. It says Ear 7 Plus. I mean, they seem to be pretty decent quality, but once again, not worth what I paid. Uh, there's a mobile game handle. That's kind of cool, but I bet you it doesn't work with my phone case. It locks together. How do you get it? Oh, that's actually kind of cool. It locks together, and then you slide your phone in there, I guess, so you can play mobile games. Or it goes... I don't know. I guess it goes like that. That doesn't make sense though. It's got to go like this. Yeah. Okay. So you can... Oh, it's got these things, these spacers in there you can pull out. Oh, well no. Maybe not. I don't know how this thing works, but it does that. It locks together. And I guess your phone is supposed to fit inside that. Maybe it's extendable a little farther? Okay, yeah. Oh, okay, it's spring-loaded. You lock it together and you can extend it like that and it clamps down on your phone. But there's no way that's going to fit on my phone. Play games. Yeah, it does not. It does not open up far enough for one. And then with my case, it's not going to fit over there. So... Yeah, let's go. I mean, these are kind of cool, but they're really cheaply made. So... Uh. I, I like the design though, they just lock together like that. Did I get my $40 worth? I don't think so. One more thing in here. An MP3 player. Like It's like a an old like second or third gen iPod shuffle. But it's like the generic version. It takes a micro SD card, so I guess you could put as much music on there as you want. And then, I don't know. Uh, it's just a shuffle, it randomly plays whatever, or plays them all in order. Neither one of those is really a, an effective way to go through your music. So, like, I mean, if this were still 2003, that would be amazing. Uh, came with some cheap, really, really cheap headphones and a, a terrible charger. But, I mean, yeah, I probably got about $15 worth of stuff out of the $40 box. At least they were electronic. For the most part, I don't even really remember what I got now. I got a phone stand, earbuds, uh, technically two sets of earbuds, an iPod, quote unquote iPod, and a mobile game handle. What else did I get? Is that it? Oh, and a, a charging cable. So yeah, there you go. If you want to buy mystery boxes off of Amazon. 
this is the best thing you're gonna get. It's the best thing I got. But mm, I got fifteen dollars worth of stuff after spending forty bucks. So I don't know. Just to throw it out there real quick before I go. Uh, these are obsolete because your phone does everything better than this could ever do. So yeah. Uh, thanks for watching and see you next time.